Blessings, Lafayette family and Facebook friends. My daily message for Friday, July 23rd. And I remind you that daily messages, Sunday worship, lots of great stuff are always at FountainChurchTallahassee.org. And join us for Sanctuary Worship every Sunday at 1030 a.m. My scripture today is Hebrews chapter 13, verse 2. Don't forget to show hospitality to strangers. For some who have done this have entertained angels without even realizing it. This is the word of the Lord. Well, a few days ago, I watched the baseball all-star game on television. First, I saw a little bit of the home run derby, and then I saw a few innings of the all-star game. And a lot of the conversation centered around a baseball player named Shohei Otani from Japan. And, by the way, I have my baseball theme here with the little baseball. And this is my mitt from my childhood. It's a Billy Martin model from when Billy Martin was actually a player. And look how different baseball gloves are today than they were then. But it served me well, and I still have it. Well, all the talk was about a Japanese player named Shohei Otani, because not only is he one of the best pitchers in baseball, he also leads the major leagues in home runs. Well, nothing like this has happened all the way since back to Babe Ruth, where a pitcher was also a hitter a regular, everyday hitter. Wow. And so the conversation was, is Shohei Otani the new face of baseball? And some said, well, he can't be the face of baseball because he doesn't even speak English and he's from another country. And I started thinking about the fact that almost everyone who ever played baseball in the United States Either they came from somewhere else or their families came from somewhere else. We were all, at times, foreigners or strangers. But what's wrong with a Japanese baseball player being the face of baseball? And why do we insist on seeing people through filters of color and race, even here in the 21st century? The fact is, there are no longer any strangers. Our world is so interconnected. And we, as human beings, are so similar to one another. Did you know that our DNA is more similar across all races, cultures, and countries than the DNA mix of any species? Any species. That means we're more alike than any creatures on earth. And so, maybe baseball can show us the way to stop looking at our differences and realize that we are all children of God, and this is one world. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you that you continue to show us that we ought to be open in our lives, and that there are no longer any strangers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.